allows you to create custom reports, which means that your reports contain all of the information you need when you need it. You might create an extensive internal report with detailed information from all of your channels, or a high-level overview report that shows your stakeholders the overall effect of your social media presence. Since you can easily adjust the date range for your report, you won't have to spend the time creating a new report each month. You can add any of the tables and charts that you see throughout Analyze to a custom report. Whenever you see a chart or a table that you wish to include in your report, simply click on the plus icon in the top right corner of the chart. You can then select which report you'd like to add the data to or create an entirely new report. You'll be able to manage your reports by clicking on Reports from the left side menu of your dashboard. From there, you'll be able to view all of your existing reports. You can delete a report that you no longer need by clicking on the X icon to the right of the report, or you can click on a report to view it in detail. Once you open up a report, the first thing you'll note is that you'll be able to modify the date range for the report. This means that for regular reporting on key metrics, you don't have to create a new report each month. You can create it once and simply change the date range. This adds a ton of efficiency to your workflow because each time you adjust the date range, the date is populated in your report's description and it'll automatically be updated. You can also customize the report title, description, and logo. You can rename your report by clicking on the existing name and then typing in a new title. You can add a description to your report by clicking on Add Report Description. And you can upload a logo to your report by clicking Upload Logo on the right-hand side. PNG and JPG files are supported. I do want to note that the ability to upload a logo is only available on our Premium Analyze plan. If you would like to rearrange your report or adjust the order of each table or chart, you can use the up and down arrows, which are shown when hovering over the table or chart. If you'd like to remove a table or chart, hover over it and click on the X icon. You can also add notes to each table or chart that you see throughout the report. This allows you to document important contexts and learnings from your analytics and speak directly to the person viewing your report. Perhaps you had a particular post that performed really well and you want to make a note of the increase in engagement rate. Or maybe you want to communicate your findings with your teammates. Notes is the place where you can do this. Once you're done customizing your reports, you can easily share the report with your team or your clients by exporting it to a PDF. To do this, click on the Export as PDF option on the top right corner of the report. All of the items that were added to the report will clearly appear on the PDF export. Awesome! You should now be able to create and manage your reports within Analyze. If you want to learn more about the various charts and tables within Analyze, feel free to take a look at the video entitled Overview of Your Analytics and Buffer. 